Hello, Flat Earth researchers, debaters, and debunkers. The physical reality that has been fobbed off on us as being a heliocentric model is not our physical reality. It is an artificial, man-made construct which has no physical form whatsoever. The heliocentric model that has the Earth as a ball spinning around the Sun as one of other planets is nothing more than a thought experiment and it is an artificial construct of time. Time that is not anything dictated by nature, but as a systematic system put in place by man to rule man across the earth. The heliocentric model of the sun in the middle of a solar system with planets spinning around it is merely an infographic or illustration of a calendar based on the solar year. No matter what celestial body you wish to put as the figurehead of a calendar to measure the passage of time. Whichever one you put, whether you use the moon or whether you measure the, uh, uh, the phases of the moon, the passing of the, the turn, the nodes of the moon, the uh, side side real time of the moon or whether you follow the sun the results are the same time is cyclical the planets the moons the stars they go around their own times, doing their orbits, movements. Now why did they pick the heliocentric model? Well, it's easier. If you want to make a lunar calendar, there's about five or six different choices which give you months with days between 27 days and 29 days in each month. A little bit difficult to work with, but it's still fairly close on a monthly basis. Follow the seasons and kind of. And a full year is 365 point something something days. Again, still not a very easy figure to work with when you want to divide things up nice and neatly, which is what people in charge like to do. So they can have the whole world waking up 
getting brainwashed, going to work, waiting for their pension, all on the same schedule. The entire world on one schedule. By put in place by those who wish to control the world's trade and the world's people as they whom which they see as being their servants cattle cash cows the entire world has been put to work for a few masters who dictate a time keeping rules, rule whatever you want to call it, that is wholly unnatural. They've given us 12 hour days only once a year does a day last for 12 hours. The rest of the time, the days are getting shorter progressively and then progressively longer. It's nature's way. So, 365 days in a year. If you are someone who wants to arrange the figures in a way that suits you and gives you a linear beginning and end idea of time, then the best thing you can do is take those 365 days and round them off to 360. And for the days you got left over, you make up leap years. So in five years, you've made up your extra days and you've got your 365 days. But when you've got 360, you can make a circle. And you can nice and neatly divide that circle up into 12 months. And in each of those months, you can have 30 days. That's the beauty of the heliocentric model. It's in the numbers, the timekeeping. That's all it is. It's a calendar constructed by man to rule man. You understand? These balls are because of bankers rounding off the numbers, taking what's left over, and hoping you won't notice. Time to wake up to the reality that space, time, is what they've been playing with. They made space out of time.